Danielle Rotundo, um, and I authorize Healthcare of Oregon to use this for educational purposes. Uh, my story starts with my boyfriend. He is a 28-year-old male that has not been able to afford health care insurance for I don't even know how many years. We fit right over the bracket to where we have to pay, and we cannot afford it. We, I am a student. I don't make any money. He pays the bills with his job. He cannot see very well at all, to be quite honest. He should not be driving. We'll be down the road. He'll ask me, what does that sign say? And I'm like, please tell me you're not serious. You can't read that. And he cannot read that. So I do a lot of the driving nowadays. And it's a little difficult with only one car. And he's the one that goes to work when I'm in school. It's very difficult. And he's not been able to see even the TV very well for at least the last year and he won't be able to get glasses anytime soon because we can't afford it sadly you uh, think that maybe everybody should have health care I believe everyone should have health care yes it's a basic right you should have access to basic doctors I don't think that anyone if you're going deaf like I presently am I'm off my parents' insurance. I can no longer go get hearing aids, so as soon as my hearing goes below what my hearing aids can help, I'm in a lot of trouble. And I don't think that any other people, especially children growing up, should have to go without that. Okay. It's just a basic thing. You should be able to live a happy, healthy, productive life at the best that you can. Thank you very much.